Hi guys, welcome back to We in the Word and Understanding the Bible Verse. Today, I read Acts chapter 6 and Acts chapter 7, and what I find interesting or what stood out to me the most is in chapter 6, starting at verse 8 all the way through verse 15. This is talking about a man named Stephen who had the Holy Spirit on him. He was doing wonders, he was doing miraculous signs, with the presence of the Holy Spirit coming from him. And he was healing people, doing all these amazing wonders and signs, and people were, most people were coming to the faith and knowing Jesus Christ and accepting him as his Lord and Savior. And during this time, there was still a group of people, just like they hated Jesus, there was still a group of people saying, how could this man still preach about Jesus? And this is what they were saying. They were arguing against this man. So they said, arrest Stephen. So Stephen goes to this court. And the Sanhedrins are sitting there. And the teachers of the law are sitting there. And they, the people who didn't like Stephen, who didn't like Jesus, they paid people money probably to go to say in court and to say he's speaking against Moses and against God. So he, they're, they're telling these people, these people all lining up because they probably all got paid to get evil money to go against Stephen and what, he, and what he's preaching. And so the false testimonies are coming up against him. And so here goes starting in verse 14. It says, for we have heard him say that this Jesus of Nazareth will destroy this place and change the custom Moses has handed down to us. So they still believe that it's Moses' law, it's Moses' tradition that's still going on. So they don't believe in Jesus. So then here's verse 15. It says, All who were sitting there, the Sanhedrin looked intensely at Stephen. And they saw that his face was, they saw that his face was like the face of an angel. So, this must have been an awesome sight to have these teachers of the law, the Sanhedrin, everybody looking at him, and his face was like an angel. And that's a really cool testimony for us to realize of, of how Stephen's face was. See, Stephen's faith wasn't part of the apostles. He was just a disciple who accepted Jesus Christ as his Lord and Savior and wanted to spread the love of Jesus because he knew what Jesus did for him in his life. So he wanted to keep on spreading that. And this is a good testimony towards us who, are, who accept Jesus Christ as the Lord and Savior that this is how we should be. We should want to strive that when people look at us, they're not lo looking at our, our face, and it appears to be like an angel. It, 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 because we're glowing with the Holy Spirit so much. So this gives me the encouragement that I need to keep on squaring the Bible, but I need to also not be have people judge me and have people say, well, he likes to wear Jesus shirts. And you know what? From now on, I like wearing my Jesus hat because yesterday as I was walking and going out shopping, people were looking at my Jesus hat and were giving me a thumbs up. That makes me feel good inside. That people were liking my hat and giving me a thumbs up. And that just makes me feel good because that means the word Jesus is still active today. It's still going around. And... The Holy Spirit hasn't stopped. The Holy Spirit is here right now. And so I think this gives us the encouragement to keep on going. Keep on preaching. Share your testimony. Read the Bible and ask God to open up your eyes. Because I think all of our goal is when we're in a crowd and when people are judging us, for us to, for our face to appear like an angel, like Stephen was. So this gives us an encouragement to keep on going and trust in the Lord stronger. So I pray this helps you guys today. Pray that you read this chapter and you grow with the Lord. 
So I pray that everything goes well. Love you guys and God bless.